Hi, my name's Helen and this is my channel, Helen Mary Jo. If you're new here, then welcome. If you're returning, thank you. And if you're a Hell's Bell, hello. hello. <laughs> oh, now Johnny thinks there's someone at the door. So it's Hatch's last day before she goes back after the summer holidays. Sad face. And Billy started his secondary school today. So I'm really, oh, I've been nervous for him all day. So I'm just hoping that he's had a good day and we'll hear all about it later. Yeah. So because Katie was working, I thought it might be nice if Hattie came out with me for a little jaunt around the shops. We kind of just did, we did home bargains. Where else? The range. The range and, Matalan. oh, Matalan just for some, that's another story, school trousers and Costco. Costco. And while we were at Costco, as, as we were parked up and Hattie was waiting for me to get the bags out of the car, a lady said hello, didn't she? Yeah, she went, hello. She said it's got to be done or something. She, she yeah, said she, she also said something like, it's got to be done, but you don't do it often in public or something like that. Yeah, so I don't know if it was one of you ladies that um, <laughs> said hello. It was very mysterious. And I don't know if it was just somebody saying hello. I, I, no, 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 she went like this, hello. She went, hello. <laughs> maybe that's how she says hello to people. <laughs> yeah, but she didn't hang around. So if it was you, hello. <laughs> anyway, I thought we'd just show you what we bought because, you know, as ever with home bargains, there's a varied mix, that's for sure. So, um, oh, the first little thing we thought we'd show you is um, actually from the range, isn't it? So yeah. do you want to tell the ladies about these? So this is an... A, a mixed alphabet bead. So Hold them up close to the camera. So because I like to do like bead things. You like uh, making bracelets and things, don't you? <laughs> yeah. And uh, you had a little friend yeah. that moved schools, didn't you? Yes. And you made one with her name on it. So yes, but she didn't come around, so I couldn't give it to her. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, anyway, never mind. It was a nice thought. And what else is when they go out with Nana, they usually get things they wouldn't get with their mum. Oh, what was um, this? This is um, Inkjoy Papermate pens. Because for school, Billy had to pens. have, what did Billy have to have? He had to have one purple pen and then one black pen. So we yeah. got a different set, it came with five pens. A black one, a blue one, a green one, a purple one. Right, don't bore everybody to death, but I mean purple. I think it's, you yeah, know, they don't like to use red anymore for corrections. So I, I got that as a backup purple pen because I know Just what's going to happen. They'll lose it. Um, so Nana tends to, you know, buy things that maybe their mum wouldn't. So <laughs> what are these? Icing. So these are two cups that are fairly big. Because Nana often gets a, gets us cups like this for Christmas. This and is just for squash, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, this one's mine, this one's Billy's. So that was just I a treat. I chose both the colours. Um, we got this for... Tiago. My little grandson, Hattie's cousin. He's coming in a couple of weeks and he loves Peppa Pig and he loves dinosaurs. <laughs> and it was only 89p. Oh, how much were those cups, I should say? How much were the cups? Um, plastic milk bottle. One. Oh, it's just, oh, it, yeah. two underneath it. So, and that's a plastic milk bottle. That's two. I don't know, but that says two at yeah, 59. So you got two. But it says two at 59 there. Is it on there? It says sand away powder. 99p, is it? I think it's both the prices at. Anyway, they, I don't know. we don't know what they were because it's very confusing. So anyway, this was definitely 89p because we can see that There's very clearly. Corner. Oh my goodness. I think it was 98p. <laughs> um, I got some of these, which are the Harpic toilet cleaners, because obviously we made those ones when I did the IBS video and they're good for kind of fragrance, but these are quite good if um like the loo in the front hall doesn't get used very often so quite often i'll just throw one of these down there to let it do its work um we got this a bit late in the season but we can shove them in the beach bag we usually use talcum powder for this 
but this is called Sand Away, the quick and easy way to remove sand from legs and feet. And it's very soft and you just pop it over where you've got sandy skin and it just brushes it off gently, you know? Like otherwise it's like you're giving them an exfoliation scrub. I always just like put my um, sliders off lip gloss on, run in the sea, quickly get wet. Yeah, then you get sand sandy again when you come yeah, out. So I got one for me and one for Casey. What's this, Hattie? Um, so this is like a pumpkin carving set. So it's got a, like a pointer thing where you like put holes in it. Then that knife you use to like, take the top off and like the face and the spade that like, shovel thing you take all the pumpkin seeds out of the middle and the reason I, I've got another one is because the blade on the like knife it just broke while I was doing it so then because we got orange ones there was a purple orange and green one my favorite color is green and so me, me and Billy can tell them apart Nana got me a green one Oh, the bottles were one twenty nine. I've worked out the receipt now, and yeah. that was uh, one twenty nine as well. That was one twenty nine, and these were one twenty nine. I knew they weren't expensive, or I wouldn't have bought them. Um, I got some more loaf cake tin liners because that's the shape cake I most make most of the time now because I pop it into the air fryer, and so I get through those very quickly. Um, I got, I'm a sucker for any kind of stationery and Rob will just be like, you got another bag to put in a bag to put stuff in. But I thought that was a handy one for travel and stuff because it, it won't get brittle. And this was just, how much was this? Uh, 79p. So it's kind of good in as much as it it's bendy so you know it's flexible so if you're like packing things and you've got a little pad you can just like fold it up yeah and, and then i mean it's very confusing because as anyone in the uk knows we're having a sudden mini heat wave at the end of the summer the very end of the summer yeah but all the shops are stocking up with christmas and halloween yeah aren't they <laughs> Like, yeah, um, in Costco there was like a skeleton with a gravestone guitar and right next to it there was like a Christmas train. <laughs> I get it in Costco a bit more because a lot of people shopping there are businesses and they have to start doing all that stuff really early. But yeah. places like the range, but as I understand it, retail really took a hammer in this summer because... Um, because we had a rubbish summer, so they didn't kind of sell their usual amount of summer gear. So they're trying to make up for it. And then the only thing that I kind of really like, which is a bit daft, but it is Christmas. Gosh, what day is it? It's only, is it the it's 5th the, of September? Yeah, 5th of September. I got this, <laughs> which is the Nutcracker Book of Tea Time Treats. And um, it's just a storage tin really, but it's airtight and it's got some shortbread biscuits in there. But once they're eaten, it'd be quite nice to put things, I always put loads of treats around at Christmas time, well, the season of Christmas. I thought it was quite nice. And how much was that? That was probably the most expensive thing that I bought, to be honest. Um, da, 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 da. How much was it? Oh, 3 99 So basically like four pounds. Basically four pounds. Yeah, so that was it. I got some... Now, I'm a little bit embarrassed to show you these because I know that um, they're kind of not very PC really, but these dust magnets, I do use them for... Um, like things like the light shades and stuff because they just kind of take the dust off like a magnet. Well, like it says on the box, they're a dust magnet. And they, and I've got some pictures that as soon as I touch them, they move all over the place. So um, I got those as well. So there's five in there and they were 2 99 So I, I suppose the they're about. how to use on the side. Well, I think it's quite obvious how to use them. You have to fluff them up. 
yeah you have to fluff up your duster so um yeah that was it really like i say i got the other sand away for katie and um yeah we had quite a nice time didn't we we got some bits in costco but they're all fairly boring um and i did buy some foliage faux foliage in the range that we are going to use i'm going to use when i i'll do that soon i can't bring myself to do an autumnal door swag when it's like 28 degrees outside so um yeah it's it's slowly ebbing away isn't it the summer but poor old billy he um he's really hurt his toe and he can't wear his official school shoes and the school is being very unsympathetic about the whole thing and said he has to wear completely black shoes and that's actually quite hard. like because Kate, he wanted trainers and you can have trainers as long as they're completely black, like no colors on them at all. So he's wearing black trainers today, but they have got some orange bits on them. But um, yeah, so I did find him some. And then um, Marks and Spencer's website played up and when Katie thought she was ordering black, and it is the website's full. I mean, so she was ordering black shorts and when she changed the order to plus um they do like an elasticated waistband because billy's quite a solid boy um they reverted to charcoal so it wasn't until after she sent him to school that she realized he was wearing the wrong color shorts so i hope they're kind to him because he was really nervous wasn't he really nervous I, I mean I'm really thinking of him all day today and just hoping hoping that he's had a good day I think it was only the first years I've gone in today we think don't we we're not uh, we're not sure I think it may have been like the whole school and the funniest thing is what's your name Harriet Grace so great uh, Hattie is Harriet Grace and um Billy's new teacher is Harriet Grace but Grace is her surname Grace is her middle name so it katie was so thrown she got an email from hattie grace which obviously we call you hattie don't we and um she could work out what was going on because it said um harriet grace was in the email and then it said my name's hattie grace and she's like why is billy school emailing me about hattie she was very very confused yeah um and it, it said something like Harriet Grace, also known as Hattie, Hattie Grace. Grace yeah, and I'm so. Harriet Grace, also known as Hattie Grace. Yeah, so that was very confusing. And um, like TMI and PS, but I had the most terrible IBS attack in Costco just now. And I thought I was going to have to tell the man on the tilt because I thought I was going to faint with it. And I, it took me every ounce of my willpower to pay and then abandon poor Hattie with the trolley. You had to wait for me, didn't you? And she said, oh, Nana, so many people came out and every time, is that funny facial pulling? Every time, you look like a little warthog. Um, so every time somebody came out, I thought it was going to be you and it wasn't you. I was like, oh, I'm really sorry, darling, but you just waited. And then I, um, when Nana came out, I quickly turned my head and saw an orange and white striped dress and I was just like, yep, that's Nana. <laughs> yeah, that's the only way you know me, is it? From my dress. And your hair. And my hair. <laughs> and hopefully my face. Yeah, but when I was just quickly looking, I so, kind of like memorize your Patty face. had the biggest ice cream on the planet today, <laughs> but we're not going to tell her mum. It was huge i mean it took you how long to eat it three quarters Four, of an hour yeah 45 minutes 45 minutes to eat this ice cream <laughs> so three really big scoops and it's like costco used the biggest ice cream scoop in the world it's <laughs> a shame it. isn't it it's just like afterwards she said oh mummy wouldn't have let me have that i was like oh thanks for telling me i didn't know how big the scoops were gonna be no that's true so. anyway this was just a little um video we just thought we'd show you share with you what we bought in home bargains and um 
yeah, that's always an eclectic mix, that's for sure. So we've covered off Christmas, holidays, Halloween. What on earth is that noise? Dolly is literally having a fit out in the garden, rolling over and over in the grass. Um, so we've done ha Halloween, Christmas, and summer holidays all in one shop. So that's not bad going, is it? Anyway, just thought I'd um, have a little chat with you and uh, we'll see you really soon. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.